dark His teeth are razor sharp There's no escape for me It was my soul, it was my heart No one can hear me scream Maybe it's just a dream Maybe it's inside of me Hey guys, I'm back. So, yeah, this is item by outside to have. So, like just now. So anyway, it's against this guy. I found a smoke on my battle. I find it, and yeah, it's got a smoke on account. And the XP post, unlike most of the people I battle. Yeah. So yeah. Anyway, check him out. Um. Anyway, oh, uh, this is item battle I had, and I'm using the same team. Except I play Skull School with an epic Skull Emily set, so you'll see about that later <laughs> later in the game. But you don't really see it too much, but it's epic. Anyway, I'm gonna leave my Deoxys, and I'm gonna set up Hazard because he's uh, crucial. He has a tentacle as you saw, but I can really care less because I know that my Gengar can just kill those niggas with their Destiny Bound. So yeah, I'm just gonna set up Hazard. He's still thinking about it. Um, I'm assuming that he's gonna go for like T Wave or Switch or something because I mean Tom's kind of obvious on Deoxys, but who knows? He might not pick up. So yeah, I'm just sitting here waiting for them to go and yeah. He goes for the Flect and this is kind of random, but okay. Uh, it really doesn't affect me too much because it's the beginning of the game and I saw from Team Play he didn't have like, too many like setup sweepers that could actually like hurt me really, so I wasn't able to do much. Anyway, he's in the beginning tentacle like I expected. Then he steps spikes. And yeah, now I'm gonna make the obvious switch at the Gengar. I don't care what he does, cause I, no, I didn't see leftovers. That kind of confused me. I figured I might see some light bulb shit, but I still want to bring Gengar because I really don't want him spinning. So whatever. And I figure that if he is life warp, then I can Destiny Bond next turn or whatever. So I'll just stay that. So yeah. Anyway, um, he's still thinking about it. So yeah. I'm looking at uh, so yeah. Toxic spikes. He's at the top, and I don't really care about that because it only affects my Deoxys D and my Mariana, which is great. I didn't even notice I was that like, at, like not weak against toxic spikes, but apparently I am. That's good. I go for Shadow Ball here because I don't think you know it's killing me. And then he pulls a random life for a Pyro Pump, and uh, so that fails. I should go for Destiny Bond. I, can't, I knew it. I knew I should go for Destiny Bond, but I didn't. So that fucks me over. So that sucks. Oh well. I started from spinning, so that's cool for me. And he just forgot about a flex as I play in this day. So now I'm retarded. I didn't even realize a flex was up. So now let's go for sucker punch to kill this thing. I don't really care if it's up toxic spice. As I said before, because it only affects my deoxys D at this point, because this thing is like poison. So I go for sucker punch like an idiot and next he kills. So good thing I actually forgot about a flex. If I more than a flex, I probably wouldn't this thing in. So it dies, that's great. My yeah, not too strong. And now he's gonna bring in something, uh heat train. He brings in heat train, which I kinda of expected because um yeah, I mean so my yeah, and I can't let really do anything heat train. So thankfully he takes some damage from Stealth Lock and Spikes, and I'm gonna go for some random lock smash. Still not knowing this will up. And yeah, it's probably gonna do like absolutely nothing. So yeah, kinda of expecting that. This will protect though, which kinda of random. I don't think it's gonna do that. But it did, so whatever. Lock smash and yeah. So you for attack. I'm just gonna go for it again because I mean I might as well. I mean there's no point in the else really. And not like sucker punch is gonna do any damage either. So yeah, I'm gonna go for the lock smash now and it's gonna hit it pretty hard. That's good. And I get a fence trap, which is always nice. And I'm pretty gonna die, but yeah, set up says like I said. So that's cool. Yeah, I kinda yeah, so uh, I believe here I'm gonna go for Lock Smash again, putting the Protect, but simply because just in case he doesn't go for it, we find him whatnot, so whatever. And not because it's just like the poison, it, I, I can still like live like two more hits of Life Orb and whatnot. So I'm gonna go for Protect, I'm gonna go for Lock Smash, and yeah. He protects now, so I'm gonna eat it, but not really. So, huh, anyway. I feel like I'm predict my switch here. I mean, predict me to go use Lock Smash here. So I'm gonna predict the switch and just go for a random crunch. I mean, it's not gonna do too much to heat slant. Uh, even the, even with like the reflect, well, I guess it'll do like a decent chunk. Probably bring it down like half or something, cause the defense drop and the reflect went off. But thankfully we can cross. I'm gonna like smash this thing with like crunch. I'm gonna do like half or something, 
And then I see the HP going down. I'm like, wait, no, I just quit it. Right? Sorry, my ears are strong, and yeah, I quit. But meh, as you can see, it probably didn't matter because, yeah, look at this. Like, I'm gonna die from poison and life will after he protects me. I have to protect with heat sand, so I didn't look at the mat too much because I could just kill him next to him. Or I just put the switch to heat sand, lock smash. So I don't think it mattered too much, but still, anyway, so it sucks. Anyway, um. He's not gonna listen. I'm gonna put the most obvious prick in the world and just go for Lord of W because it's like the best Pokemon I guess guy's team right now. So yeah, I can't kill Heatran obviously. So I'm bring that in and here I'm going to put the protect because he doesn't see leftovers. So I'm assuming it takes his choice glove. So I'm gonna go with that theory. Just go for Volt Switch, because I kinda want this thing gone. Cause I feel like if I Volt Switch he then he protects, he'll stay in, think I'm scarlet, I can hide up on put to death, and I'll be good. But instead, um he actually just let me switch it. I'm not sure why he didn't put. Uh, I guess he thought it was like some like web set or something. Who knows? Anyway, he brings this out. There's no way in hell he thought of that if I built it. Anyway, he's bringing this out. I'm gonna go for Volt Switch. Get that off. And now I'm gonna bring in Scarlet. Simply because it's like the best thing that can actually do anything of this. Because, I mean, well. Deoxys D is just set up for it. Legolas is gonna get owned. My Yen is dead, and Lodom obviously it can't do shit. So I'm bringing Big Bird, my Scarmly. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. So I actually do get to use this thing, so that's pretty cool, but not what I really want to. He goes for Karma. I'm not sure why. I guess he put me to use Spikes, but he Heat Trans Switch. But if I put the Heat Trans Switch, I have a normal Scarmly, I'll just go for Whirlwind, but who knows? Anyway, I can flip. So now I'm officially happy. So, I'm bringing the most obvious heat trans switch in now because the only thing on this team that can leave threaten me and I've already seen before, so it's not to bring it out. They won't be able to settle anything. So, I'm bringing that in, obviously. I'm gonna sack my Gen to avoid taking any damage and just to stop him from like using some stupid prediction shit with Zul and whatnot. So, I'm gonna sack that because it's gonna die to lock. So, that works out pretty well in my favor. So, good thing I saved it, I guess. So, uh, I'm gonna sack this. And here, I believe I'm bringing in Lucario because he has Kingdra, Heatran, and Mammoth Swan left. None of them can take a close combat. So, that should seal it, I'm pretty sure. So, I'm gonna go for Lucario here because it's. And you can't protect either to stall me because by SD it's like completely over. So, I'm gonna go for close combat here because there's no point doing anything else. I know I don't need an SD to win this game. So, close combat, dead, KO. At this point, I'm still kind of worried about Kingdra though, because that shit can fuck me over. Because if he has a lane dance, that, that thing can like clean sweep me and push it. I'm just like life will stall. It's gonna be like impossible. With like a lane I'm not out of stall with a lane dance. I, I really don't have much faith in that. So, I know I'm bringing it now though, because look how I can kill it. Same with the mammal. Here, I don't think Bullet Punch can kill. I'm pretty sure it can't, because it's a mammal with decent defense. And, I mean, it's Bullet Punch. It's like. It's really not that strong. I'm pretty sure it's like 60 valve, yeah, so it's like 120 after the super effective, yeah, I don't, I don't have much faith in that. Here yeah, I'm bringing Big Bird, because I can take it, you know, for super power, and whatnot, and here I'm gonna go for Agility. Yeah, that's right, Agility is calling me, like, get the fuck at me. So I'm bringing that in, go for that, Agility, and he's probably like flipping out right now, like what the fuck Agility is calling him, what the hell. So yeah, I knew he wouldn't switch, because, I mean, Whirlwind's kind of obvious here. So, he's going for Super Power again, I don't care, I'm going to go for Agility, and, I'm going to go for Agility, and, yeah, here I'm debating between going for Loost, which, I was going to go for that, but then I thought about it, and I said, if he had Lady Dance King Jill, he would just use Lane Dance, and then I couldn't kill it in one shot, and then he'd probably just sweep me with, like, Hydro Pump, so that would be a really bad idea. So instead, I just let him hit me, not go for loose, and I go for Swords Dance, yeah. Agility, Swords Dance, Scarmly. Get at me. It's like Double Dance, Hockey on, except it's Scarmly. What now? So, that's just epic. So I'm gonna go for that, and I realize he always scarfed, which I didn't see coming. I don't know why. I thought it might be like Focus Dash or something, I don't know. But it works out in the end, because if I went for Agility there, I told you, if I went for loose there, I would've lost. Assuming he had Lane Dance, so whatever. He kills me, but that doesn't matter because the game is mine now. So, because Lucario, Bullet Punch, you can easily always KO. Plus, a minus 4 defense man was fine. And then, close combat, easily always KO. Kingja, and he switches out. 
I can just bullet punch, he'll get half health thanks to Henry Hazards. So he switches pointlessly, takes my bullet punch. He really kill us though, because as I said before, close combat is gonna like whoop this thing. Because the cardio is just too strong. So yeah. The good man, Juju. Our first collab, guys. So yeah. Comment, like, subscribe, like, do all the shit. Peace people. His teeth are razor sharp There's no escape for me It was my soul, it was my heart No one can hear me scream Maybe it's just a dream Maybe it's inside of me Stop this monster I feel it deep within It's just beneath the skin I must confess that I feel like a monster I hate what